Hi everyone, welcome to my channel. My name is Amy and I am here with a Timu, oh, Timu haul. <coughs> okay, hang on. I just was drinking water. I got something in my throat. Today, we had a potluck at work and I got a piece of chocolate chip cookie, but it was kind of like partially cooked chocolate chip cookie, like stuck in my throat. And it actually kind of scared me for a bit because I could still breathe, but I could not get it to move. It was stuck. So I ended up having to go in to the bathroom and like cough and stuff a bunch for it to come up. But well, not come up, but just, just dislodge. So I think ever since then, my throat's been kind of sore. And now my nose is running and I've got a red nose. What is going on? All right, whatever. Okay. So first, I think this is perfume. I think. La Star Paris. Got some scissors. There is a perfume that I really want to get on Timu. That is, oh, excuse me, that is vanilla and coconut. And I'm wanting to see if it's a dupe for my, my expensive perfume that I got from Lush because it is kind of a vanilla coconut one too. But I wanna see, but it's only available local warehouse. And while I did finally order something from local warehouse for my dad for his birthday, I'm not willing to buy a $6 item and pay $2.99 shipping for it. Okay, this is, oh, so cute. Okay, so what do we have here? La Star. For my love, you are the sunshine in my life, the love that never fades. Aw. And okay, so we have eight bottles of perfume. Let's see if they are labeled. Summer Juice. Okay, I can't, I'm not gonna be able to spray all of these because then I'll be in sensory overload. They do have expiration dates on them. So they are good through 2029. Summer juice. I'm not very good with, like it's easier for me to describe foods than scents. But I mean, that one smells fresh. And this one is Monet Garden. It smells florally. I don't know if these are all flowers. I'm hoping there's some fruits in here too. For one night. Oh, that one smells nice. Okay, that's my favorite so far. Let me set this out because whichever one I think is my favorite, I'm going to try to use. Cool Town. Hmm. Yeah, I'm not I'm not a very good hauler of scents, I guess. Plaid skirt. Yulong tea. Hmm. That one definitely smells like a green tea. Gardenia and Jasmine. Jasmine is one of my favorite teas. This smells a little bit more heavier on the gardenia side though. And Wild Rose. Yeah, so I'm thinking 
That one smells nice. I'm thinking that they are all on the floral, but this one, okay, for one night is my favorite one of them that I could, you know, smell from just smelling the container. Oh, oh I really like that. But again, I don't know how to tell you what they smell like. I can't. Oh, it almost smells like there's, no, I was going to say chocolate, but no, when I go this way, it's definitely floral. We'll see what the um, description says, but that's, I like that. Okay. I like that. They're good little amounts that you could easily stick in your purse and it has a nice, it doesn't, you know how some body sprays, the cheap body sprays, it's like you can smell them for a couple minutes and then they're gone. This one smells like actual perfume. Yeah, I like that. All right, let's see. I think that was in our recent order. And some of this stuff, I'm like, when am I going to get to haul those things? Oh, this, this thing came, okay, there it is. It's like it came all by itself in a package. Okay, I paid $8, so it was a dollar a bottle. La Star Eau de Toilette Women's Spray Perfume Gift Set. Eight piece fresh scented floral, citrus, wood, and oriental fragrances, formaldehyde free liquid, alcohol content, perfect for daily use and gifting. And it is currently $8.72, which is still a good price. Let me see if it okay, it does have the what they are. All right, so Monet Garden is flower and fruity. Summer Juice is Citrus Fragrance. For One Night is Oriental Vanilla. So that's why I like it, because I love vanilla. I don't know what makes it the, ori like what's the Oriental piece of it? Oh, <laughs> wish I could say. Wish I had a better nose. Cool Town is Aquatic Modulation. Well, that, who knows what that means. Plaid Skirt is Floral and Fruity. Yulong Tea is Citrus Wood. Wild Rose is Wood and Floral. And Gardenia Jasmine is Floral Fragrance. So, if you're someone who likes those kind of scents, this would be a really good deal. Because then... You know, a lot of times you're spending that for the cheap body sprays and you're only getting one cent. So the fact that you get eight with this seems like a really good deal. And I really, I really like this one. Oh man. Okay, but that's good that I like it, right? And I like how it makes me smell feminine. I went for so long not wearing perfumes and stuff because it would irritate me and I, I don't know I was just overly sensitive with my nose but now that I've gotten older I, I guess I can't smell as well and so so yeah and I'm one of those people that like my husband when he showers and he gets out of the shower and stuff he smells like what he what soap he used I get out of the shower and I don't smell like anything which is I guess better than smelling how I smelled before I got in the shower but yeah I don't I don't retain those kind of smells very well that's weird isn't it all right this is the necklace that paired with the necklace I had on my last video and this is the red one and it's again it's a shimmery I don't even know how to describe 
to describe it. So one of you, I'm sure, will have a better. Iridescent is the word I was trying to think of in that other video. So it's kind of, I don't know, can things be iridescent that aren't that white kind of iridescent? So anyway, the one I had on the last video was blue, and this is the red one. But see how vivid that is? That's a really pretty shimmery, and this is, there's tons of jewelry on Timu right now with these petals, but it's kind of a V drapey, drapey thing on a gold chain. Again, you can buy these as singles or you can buy the blue and the red as a set. And I do not remember what these cost. So, I paid $340 for the blue and the red together. And they are still $340, but they, it also comes in green, which is really pretty kind of a teal kind of a green. And rose red are the other two colors. And if you just buy a single, they're $1.79. So I think I like the green one, so I'm gonna put that in my cart. Yeah, I just like how bold they are. So let's talk, let's talk outfit. So I'm wearing my green pair eyewear magnetic, change up my look for every outfit that I wear. And I've got my referral code linked below. I'm not sponsored, they don't know who I am, although I would like to have a job with them because I highlight their stuff on almost every video. I love them. And then I'm wearing my Timu earrings. And this is a Timu shirt that I hauled recently. Now, I feel like it needs a button here. So I will probably find something, a pin, you know, I can just pin it, you know, without you being able to see. Cause I feel like it looks better like this. This looks kind of, makes it look a little bit too big for me. But I don't think it is, but anyway, it's got this cool geometric, and it's kind of a nylon-y kind of feel to it. And then it's got this polyester. I mean, they're not pretending trying to make it seem like it's um, layered, but it only comes to here. And, and then it has kind of a rounded edge which definitely you can wear with jeans, it, or not jeans, leggings, because it comes down past the butt and the back is, you know, all the way to the back. So I really like this and it's got a little poof on the sleeves. I just am going to find a way to pin this. And I think it would also look better with my hair down instead of in a ponytail. And then I could wear some jewelry, right? So yeah, I like this. I just need to, this is my one complaint about it. But I think it's a great length and no complaints. No complaints, except for this. So yeah, and it goes okay with my green glasses. That's the important part. Oh no, I have a wig. <laughs> in this episode. Oh, and another giveaway. So if you're new, I'm occasionally doing giveaways of small little Timu things to just express my thanks for those of you that watch and support this channel. I did finally cross over 2010 subscribers. So I'm hoping this weekend to film my, I'm gonna do a $25 Timu giveaway to one of you. It, 
you have to live in the States for that one. And I'm going to try to show some of my favorite Timu products that I own and use regularly. And then, so I'm going to try to get a combination of those that comes to about $25. And then that will, I will order those things for the winner and they will just get shipped to the winner straight from Timu. So that is my appreciation for hitting 2,000 subscribers. And I waited till I got over 2,010 just to make sure, because I do, I do flip flop a lot with my subscribers. But anyway, this is a free giveaway in this video. And however many of these I can mail for an ounce will be what the winner gets. If for some reason I have to like split it in half, then there will be two winners. But these are kind of stampy, stampy ones. Um, what would you call these? Yeah, they're kind of for posters. Well, because I need a keyword and I don't want to use stamps because I use that in another one, let's just call this posters. We'll say posters will be the keyword and I'll put that I'll put that down below in the description. And I do the drawings for my winners of these kind of things on Sundays. So whichever videos have aired during the week that have a giveaway, I'll do them on Sundays and then I post the winners in my community feed and I tag them. And you can live anywhere in the United States or anywhere in the world for this giveaway. And you don't have to be subscribed, although it would be nice if you were. But you'll never have to prove that you are. So, but again, this is just my thanks. I like I think Timu's a great source for craft items and let's be real, these are cheap, so it's an easy way for me to do multiple giveaways um, for people who like stickers. So far, they've all been stickers that I've done. Okay. Posters. We said posters was the keyword. I got to say that a couple times so that I remember to put it the right thing in the description. Okay, I think it's in this order. Yes, okay, so I paid $1.64 for that. And it is a 50 piece retro decorative stamp stickers, waterproof cool stickers for DIY book, guitar, helmet, skateboarding again, luggage, laptop, gift toy stickers, collection only. And it's currently $1.73. But yeah, Timu's great source for any kind of crafting. And if you're new to crafting or you wanna take up a brand new craft, try it out on Timu because you can get, you know, a few things for that craft and not spend an arm and a leg just to find out maybe you don't like it learn from my mistakes. All right, next we have another one of these Egyptian drawstring bags. This one in blue. And these make great things to give gifts in if you're trying to be, con you know, echo, echo conscious. That doesn't sound right. If you are trying to be environmentally conscious, you can, you know, put it, this is like a gift card, perfect for like a gift card. And it's just a simple, thin kind of canvasy Egyptian style drawstring bag. I have them in, I think four different colors, maybe five different sizes. This is kind of the three by five inch size. And I paid 44 cents, got a price adjustment. 
It's currently still 44 cents. One piece Egyptian pattern linen drawstring bag, gift packaging bag, jewelry, gift, candy, blah, blah, blah. So I like, I'm not good at gift giving or wrapping or anything, but this would be, is a nice way, you know, to give somebody a gift without it taking a lot of effort, if I can be so frank. I mean, it's not that I don't want to take effort. What is that? It's not that I don't want to put in effort. I'm just not very good at it. <laughs> it's my, it's my things flip. Okay, next are some earrings. Really pretty earrings. They come with silicone backs. And they look like this. I love that resin kind of look. Reminds me of the resin in the hair care products that I hauled from Ann Gabriel. That was a couple episodes back. So if you like things like this, go check that video out. Hop over to her YouTube channel, show her some love and yeah, but I, I like this kind of dangly kind of, and I love these colors. So, all right, where will I find them though is the question. got one more bag upstairs but I feel I feel like oh there they are I feel like I'm seeing way more things that aren't that I haven't hauled yet now is this the same thing okay in the picture I'm gonna show you the picture but but in real life this is got some green tint to it it's not a, like a baby blue. It's really got like a light teal look, but in the picture, it's more blue, like a grayer blue, baby blue kind of thing. So that is a little different, but I kind of like this better, if I'm being honest. I've got things in both of those colors that it'll go with. I paid 77 cents. They're now 97 cents and they are called chic blue irregular round stud earrings. Versatile and stylish, perfect for vacation and casual wear. Hypoallergenic steel post. So that's good for those of you that that are very sensitive to metal. But yeah, I like those and I'm kind of glad it's not the colors that were in the picture. Next is a dress. Okay, so when I first found this, sorry, when I first found this dress, I either couldn't find it in my size or the listing I had didn't go up to my size or down to my size. I don't remember which side of the house I found this on. What does it say? 1XL. Okay, so this is on the plus side. And I think the 1XL was constantly sold out. But I love it because it's got a V-neck. And at the waist, then you've got all of the, just the rainbow colors. Now, I will say in the picture, I felt like it looked a little bit more pleated here with the colors so that they kind of grew out from kind of a black starting point. But you can see here, it's just elast an elastic waist. No um, belt or anything. But I just really, really liked the bright colors and
Okay, so it comes to my calf is how long it is. And that perfume, I am loving it. It still smells fantastic. Now the bottom of this is more nylon, but the top, the top is, this part is super soft um, polyester, but then this part, in order to get these bright colors, it's more nylon. And would probably look great with my rainbow glasses. Okay. So it's starting to get cold in my office, you guys. I'm gonna have to take a, a sweater or something that I can have there while it's cold. I was, we had, well, for our potluck, we were all kind of out in the big room where the kitchen and stuff is. And I was like, oh, someone was like, do you want my sweatshirt? And I'm like, no, I'll be fine. And I was like, I'll go eat some sugar and that'll raise my blood sugar, which will raise my body temperature. So then they were giving me a hard time about diabetes, of course. And um, so, so that was of course fun. But yeah, I am, since I've lost weight, I am so sensitive to cold weather. Like I have no tolerance for it. I mean, so literally all the body fat that I had was keeping me well insulated. So sometimes I miss that. I don't miss the weight, but sometimes I do miss, like I don't like being super sensitive to the cold. All right, this dress, I paid 10.68. It is currently 15.48, that's crazy. See, now, why is that? That's like a, what a, 50% increase? They have it in sizes 1XL to 5XL, which is great. But, um, but yeah, 1548. So, of course, during the winter, I'm going to have to wear it with a sweater. Ooh, but think of all the different colored sweaters I could get to go with it. So I guess I was wrong. In the picture, it's really not pleated up at the top. So I think that's pretty accurate to what it looks like. I'm saving the wig for, for last. It's kind of bold. All right, now I accidentally ordered this twice. I think this is the first time I'm showing it on here but it is questions for humans, for couples, but we'll see if that's, if it's really is for couples or not. A lot of times these card things say for couples, but they're just kind of generic questions. But this would be a good kind of a, a good kind of a box to put in the car for when you're on a road trip with someone you could go through these. All right, so let's just, it seems like about the size of a deck of cards, which is what, 52 or 54 if you count jokers? Okay. Hey, good folks, whether you've been together 20 minutes or 20 years, these questions will help you get to know each other better. Take turns, choose to be honest, honest, listen well, be kind, and don't take yourselves too seriously. All right, so I'm just gonna read, um, read a few questions. What are you addicted to that's perfectly legal? 
um, the rookie, <laughs> um, chocolate, um, sugar, soda, getting the drift here. Um, what else would I be addicted to? Well, Timu, <laughs> can't forget that. All right, so that was a good one. Um, okay, what household chore do you hate the most? So see, these are generic, that you don't have to be a couple. Um, what household chore do you hate the most? Hmm, I don't know, I hate all cleaning, which is not a surprise to you guys, but I can handle doing laundry. I can handle doing the dishes but I guess maybe I would say cleaning the tub because, or floors. Like I can't get on my knees anymore unless I've got padding and stuff. So it's really hard to wash floors well. And I feel like when you're washing the tub, I've got, I've got stuff from Timu, you know, like those electric spinner things brush spinner brushes that are supposed to make it so easy but I feel like you have to have like a special toolkit to clean the tub and it's not as easy as just cleaning a mirror or cleaning off a countertop kind of thing oh or the microwave that's not any fun either so yeah so I'd probably say I'd probably say the tub so anyway that gives you an idea of what kind of cards so yeah, so maybe what I'll do is since I accidentally ordered two, I'll put one in the car. Well, I could give one to my daughter. She's got a car now and she could put it in her car for whenever she goes out. Bow chicka wow wow. <laughs> but it says this is the couple's edition, but I'm, so I'm curious if there's other additions. Wouldn't that be nice if I thought I ordered it twice, but I really ordered two different additions? But yeah, I don't think that's I don't think that's what I did. So let's see what that cost. All right, four ninety four. I paid four ninety four. I got two price adjustments. And it's still, or it's 404 now. Okay, so they're calling this Couples Conversation Starter. Premium card game for ages 14 and up. Well, my kids could answer that question of what household chore they hate the most. Engaging party game for relationships. So, oh, and here's the one that they show on the screen. If you could live today over again, what would you do differently? Well, I would take a sweater to work so that I didn't freeze. And I'd be extra careful when I ate that partially cooked chocolate chip cookie dessert so that it didn't get stuck in my throat. Okay, there you go. All right, are we down to just, no, we're not down to just the, The green version of these bracelets that I feel like remind me of Outer Spirit. So you get a set of four, four bracelets. Now these, these all seem kind of like the same size. If you remember from my blue ones, it seemed like there was one that was kind of a different size than the others, but these seem all pretty similar. But anyway, you get four coordinating. Yeah, see, these are these are better than the other one. So I guess, you know, for what you're paying, you might you might get one that doesn't quite match up. But anyway, these look good together, and they're all kind of the same size. So, um, but anyway, you get four four that coordinate with each other and I think they had six different versions of this and I've ordered three of them. I already showed you guys the blue one. This is the green. I paid $2.19. I got a price adjustment 
and oh, it comes in nine different color coordinator co coordinations. And it's currently still 219. Four piece vintage style artificial crystal bracelet set. Multicolor refreshing elastic string. Women's party hand jewelry accessory. But yeah, I like this one better than the blue one just because. Do I still have the blue ones? What did I do with those? Okay, well, maybe I already set them aside for to be put away because I don't see them. But anyway, yeah, the like the solid blue one was smaller, so it didn't it kind of sat up here while the rest of them came down. So yeah, I like this one better. And it's pretty. I like green. I don't know that it necessarily goes with well this one kind of goes in this one. But these are a little bit more on the green side. So yeah, I could do that with this outfit. Or most people aren't as matchy-matchy as me, so they would just wear them all together. But yeah, I like that. I like that look. It gives you kind of a polished look all in one set. All right, next I got some more of these wooden earrings. These are huge, guys. That's one thing that you can get surprised with, with earrings. Sometimes earrings are definitely larger than you expect. And look at that. So they're just wood. You could make, if you had a Cricut, you could probably make these yourself. And let's just try them on. Or at least one of them. Shoot, I never do a terrible job at posing for thumbnails. And when I do pose for thumbnails, apparently I don't pose long enough because when I try to stop on it while I'm in the video, it it's hard. Wow, that is huge. Let's try the other one on, get the full effect. Oh! Oh, so I don't know, you guys, not that you care, but I have been looking for a powder to replace my powder that I love that was, well, I thought discontinued, but um, I found it. So I don't know, maybe it was just sold out before, but when I was going through, I started going through every single order I've ever placed because I was trying to decide you know, like what my favorite things are for this giveaway that I want to do. And I came across where I had first ordered that powder and it's kind of a pinkish, but it's still, it's still a complexion color. Um, so not like a solid pink, like some of the ones I've gotten lately, but when I got, or when I clicked on it, it was still available. So I ordered four because <laughs> I thought I got to get them in case this ever happens again. And so that was exciting. But yeah, these are kind of big. I don't have as much space for earrings on this side because, you know, my head's kind of tilted. But these are pretty big. And these probably will work their way out of my ear because of how they hit against my shoulder. So I'll definitely have to put a back. They didn't come with backs, but I'll have to put one of my backs my silicone backs on it. But yeah, I like these. I like, you guys know, I like these geometric. But yeah, unfortunately, earrings like this do make it more obvious that my head is crooked. <laughs> my face is crooked. My ears are crooked. I have to like tilt in an awkward way <laughs> to make that straight. So yeah, so since I've got a wig coming up, I'm going to just take these out too. But let me find those. I like those. I mean, I've gotten those now in several different shapes. 
because I just like them. Obviously, I guess. Okay, I paid 83 cents. I got five price adjustments. They are currently 45 cents and you can also get them in green and brown. Creative multi-layer wooden round pendant design dangle earrings, vintage bohemian style for women, autumn fall ear decor. All right, okay, now I'm a little worried because, oh, this one's not quite as, I ordered a maroon wig. This is not that one I thought it was. So this one is just a brown kind of wig. I think it's a full wig and not just a topper, but I guess I won't swear to that. It's a 12 inch, which should come about to my shoulders, I've learned. But it's a pretty kind of golden brown color. It's got a net around it. Oh, it does have bangs. It does have a tag, which I'll leave on for now. And it's got a little padding in here to help it hold its shape. And then the inside looks like this and it's got the straps that you can use to help tighten it. And then it's got a pretty good part in it and it's straight and it feels, it feels pretty good. It doesn't feel super slick. Um, but yeah, let's see, let's see how this goes. <laughs> All right, the bangs are really long, so I would have to trim those up and they're kind of stuck underneath the okay hold on I all of a sudden also need a drink okay um it's not it's not at all pulled down enough in the back okay it's covering my ponytail, but I would, you know, if I were gonna wear this out in the world, I would, um, I would need to do more. I'm trying to make sure that none of the rest of this is stuck underneath. Okay, so if I were going to keep this, I would be trimming these bangs up just a little bit. Um, oh, as I jam my finger in my, so yeah, you can see I didn't get it quite pulled down Let's see, pull it up just a little bit maybe that'll help um, so this so whereas I love this color and a younger me would have worn or dyed my hair this color it does not do well for my skin tone that I've got right now um, yeah, it's a really pretty color, but it's, it's not doing me any favors with my skin. Let me get, let me get some of my Anne Gabriel hair clips out. So that we can try a few different ones of these and see how they look. Oh, I'm going to get ones that kind of look 
would look good with this color hair. But yeah, see, that's like too red for me. Okay. Truth be told, when I was getting married to Jason, I went and had my hair professionally colored and it ended up being pretty similar to this color. And I felt like Ronald McDonald, probably because it just didn't look right for me. Um, now my, I had long hair, so this is definitely like short for me. Can this part change? I never know with these, when they have parts, if they can kind of change, but this one seems pretty defined, but you could work with it, right? So let's take one of these. Now I'm not, you know, <laughs> you can still see some of my hair up there. Um, maybe I would want this one for kind of over here. It's like, why get a wig with bangs if you don't want the bangs? Well, I need to cut the bangs. So this is not a good representation of how to use her beautiful clips. This one I'm finding harder to manipulate than some of the other ones that I've had. But yeah, if I were gonna keep this, I would definitely pull this down a little bit more and then I would cut those bangs a little bit because they're too long, but they're not long enough to like put behind my ear kind of thing. So yeah, I'm having a hard time a hard time with this one. So whereas I kind of like the style, the color is not right. Is that my hair? Yeah, and that's my hair that I didn't get pulled up into it. So maybe if this were a light brown or a, you know, going on gray or that kind of thing, or gray blonde, it would be better, but this is not a good color. And I'm gonna bet that the maroon one also will not be a good color. My gosh, it'll like make me look super pale and then really bring out all these extra spots. But anyway, let's do our standard wig pose. What would this look like with a hat? I don't know, because I didn't think to bring a hat down here, but the way this flips probably would make it good for a hat. And you could then just kind of pull these bangs out of the way. Ouch. It's like catching on my finger. So yeah, I think this would have been better if it had just had all long hair and no bangs where I could pull pull them out of the way. So, all right, well, let's see what we paid for this. I really like the color, but it does not like me. Just can't handle golden beauty. This one. So they called this brownness. Wait. Maybe that's not this one. Shoot. Now I don't know if this, if the cut is the same, but they call this the package just says brown 12 12 inch this one says brown ness and they usually match so let me just check real quick to make sure 
that I didn't order two that were similar. I wish you could like search by the sticker description, you know? Guys, it's 10.30. What am I still doing? <laughs> what am I still doing? But I am starting to think it's the, that it's this, it's that one, but I'm gonna look at. Okay, yeah, it's gotta be that one. Well, presuming it's this one, it looks browner in the description or in the picture than real life. Like, I feel like this one's almost coral. Like they have a coral one. But anyway, this is brown. Maybe it's not the exact same thing, but the cut is the same. It's got bangs and it's short like this. So we're just gonna say it is the same thing. I paid $10.47 for and it is 12 inch, and it's now $12.47, and it comes in five different colors, and it is a short, straight bob burgundy wine, red hair, wigs with bangs, heat resistant, so I could curl this if I wanted fiber fluffy hair music festival <laughs> all right well now I know what I'm wearing when I go to the next music festival and I would definitely wear a wig cap with this so that all my stuff was out of the way and I probably need to um, miss Adrian said that those um, kind of silicone strips that you can wear with them also help hold it in place. So yeah, I think this, I like, I really like this color, but it, I do not like it on me. Or at least maybe it's the green, like, is it better? Yeah, it's probably a little bit better like that than that. Maybe that is make a difference. I don't know. Should I take another picture with it? Probably not, because now you can still see my the white in the way. All right, well, that was it for this haul. Thank you so much for spending time with me today. And um, if you enjoyed this content, please give me a thumbs up. Please consider subscribing. And thank you to all of you who have already subscribed and to everyone who leaves kind comments for me below. I love reading those. And wherever you are, whenever you are, I hope you're having a great day. And until we meet again, take care of yourself. Bye.